Here at Navigator North Tees we carry out loading operations including train loading on behalf of Green Energy. The whole of the stock control is from Green Energy Operations based in London and they coordinate between Seal Sands, Navigator North Tees, Cardiff Terminals and the train. So the train has 22 wagons, each wagon is 98,000 litres, the whole train can carry 2.2 million litres of petrol, that's enough to fill 51,000 cars. So the petrol comes to this terminal from our sister terminal, Navigator Seal Sands. We're conscious about doing things safely. The operators carry out a check to make sure there is no damage to the train. There are no leaks on the train and everything is as it should be. Once we've carried out our pre-safety checks, we can start to load the train. So this consists of connecting a scully lead, connecting a vapour hose and connecting a liquid hose. During the filling operation we generate petrol vapours. We collect these through a vapour recovery hose into a vapour recovery unit where we convert these back into liquid petrol. Every cubic metre of air we displace contains 1.39 kilograms of petrol. For loading the rail cars we use a system called bottom loading where we load the petrol from the bottom of the rail car and it's safer because all the operations take place from ground level. When the petrol flows, our uh, control room monitors flow, temperature and level during the petrol transfer to the rail car. The operators remain vigilant to ensure there's no leaks or spills. This process is computer controlled but there's a good deal of human involvement. Each wagon takes approximately 47 minutes to load. We load two rail cars at the same time so we can be as efficient as possible. So to load all 22 rail cars takes approximately 12 hours. Once the train is fully loaded, we carry out one final safety check to make sure all the valves are closed and all the caps are in place. Once we hand over the train to GBR Rail Freight, they couple up, recharge the brakes and do a final brake test before setting off for Cardiff Terminal. 